What's up, y'all? Today is the day I'm actually going apartment hunting for the first time in like a year, year and a half. It's crazy. Like this whole journey to this process has been just. I'll, I'll get into that in another video. I know I haven't really talked about it much since I just really released the debut not too long ago. But man, it's it's very fulfilling, and I know it's the apartment shopping process isn't always the best thing. From what I can tell by other videos, but. I'm so excited, I'm looking forward to it. Um, yeah, um, I'm just ready to get ready. I'm about to brush my teeth, put some clothes on, and I'm about to head down the street. Let's get it. It's the fit for the day, you feel me? Doing a little, little retro vintage vibe, you dig? Fresh cut, you feel me? Like, it's about to be a good time. Let's get it. But yeah, we about to see what they're talking about. The first one I met is in Midtown, West Midtown, technically, which is really Bankhead, but. Um, everything I'm looking at today is like loft style, so we'll see. Let's check it out. location now um this bit got an echo <laughs> but the first one lost style apartments it was cool they toured they helped they showed me the 720 square feet and i feel like for myself it was definitely cozy but i feel like i'm living in a cramped space right now in my room and with the furniture they had in there and the relative furniture that i want to get like it's a good space, it's a good space. I'm not really, I'm not crossing it off my list yet, but I definitely wanna see some more. I definitely like it, I like the apartment, I like the location it was in. Um, yeah, we'll see, but we're at the next location. Uh, I'll try to get some more B-roll to show y'all, and uh, yeah. So just left that one. I really liked it. Um, definitely gonna take time to, you know what I'm saying, think over, pray, meditate over all of my decisions. Right now we in a uh, little five points. I'm out with my friend right now as I wait for my next appointment at four o'clock. Um, this is actually, the next one's gonna be like the first lofts that I wanted to go to when I first got, when I first got to Atlanta. So we're gonna see, they definitely dope. But uh, let me show y'all the food we about to get. Yeah, countertops and five. Oh, this 
Now this is crazy. This is nice as well. It's a pretty big fun. It's gonna be a hard decision. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be a hard decision, bro. No, it's nice. Yeah. The biggest things was like just separation of spaces. And I got also uh, a Alright, so I just toured the last spot. Um, I ain't gonna lie. I'm kind of torn right now. Uh, yeah, I can sit and stare at this guy for, for an hour. I'm gonna definitely, I'm gonna give it time to sink in. Uh, I'm going to try to pray, meditate over, let it sit for a few days. And both times, I've seen only the model units, so I'm not sure if I've if I seen the actual units that I would, um, that are actually, i seen, well, at Fulton, I saw an, a, a model, a unit that's able to move in, but at this one, I wasn't able to, so... Just gotta let it sit. I'm really torn. They're both great properties. Um, both have great things that I can give and take from. And both are like, I think the biggest thing is that both are, are both facilities that like I really wanted to be a part of. Uh, so now it's game time, decision time. So yeah, I think I'm about to finally head back now. I just hit um the film store that I'll be sending my film to up here. Uh, I live two hours away. Like, I don't come up here as often anymore. So like, just whenever I do come up here, I try to multitask to get a lot of things done. Um, a lot of, just like the only one, of the main reason I want to come up here is the creative community. So we don't have a film developing spot in Augusta. So I come up here to the photo spot and they get me right every time. Um, I took some pictures of my grandparents and my parents uh, for Father's Day. I got them developed, and I think I'm going to get them printed out, so I might record that as well. And, but it's been a long day. Been up since it's like six. Been up since early eight. Freaking bro, I'm still like even on the drive here. It's like <laughs> all I've been thinking about is the pros and cons of these two apartments, bro. Like, oh my goodness. Hopefully, the, I, I already know the Lord will lead me to the right decision, man. And ain't it's really, it's really, it's really, bro, I could talk about this all day, bro. But yeah, uh, I'm about to head back. I'm going to try not to think about the apartments. Uh, it's just so much now. Like, even now, I'm, a, I'm over here up in, up in Douglasville, and I see a home store. We passed the Bed Bath & Beyond, and like right now, you know, they're going out of business. So it's a lot of deals on with them. And like... You can't have a loft without plants. And I, we just pulled up on a plant spot. Or like the photo store is literally right next to the film store. So it's crazy. Um, man, it's a lot going on. Finally have emotion. So I'm, I'm very, very, very grateful. Like so grateful. No lie. So grateful. But um, this is when the business and actual like, you know, handling, handling everything comes in. So I still got much, a lot of time. I really... Don't plan on moving for the next two months or plan on moving like within the next two months. So Lord's willing, hopefully everything will go smoothly. Have a lot of time, have a lot more money to save, a lot more things to do. So I really just wanted to show you guys what has been on my mind, like what it is that I like, what it is that I've been shopping for. Like, bro, ever since I graduated school and like back in 2021, that's crazy. Like I sound mad old, even though I'm mad young, but Ever since I got away to school, like I just wanted a loft, bro. And just at the end of 2021, I thought I was gonna move. Didn't happen. But you know, I'm like, okay, 2022, you know what I'm saying? You might not move directly after you graduate as college, you feel me? And I needed I needed more money, I need to save, like, so boom, boom, that's cool. But then 2022, I'm like, definitely by the fall, I'ma move. Got to the fall, I'm like, definitely by the end of the year, I'ma move. Got to the end of the year, I'm just like, yo. Lord, what's going on? Like, what is my life right now? Like, I'm still at home, bro. Like, um, numerous friends of mine are even going back to school or like graduating and moving off. And I'm just like, I'm still not in the same exact spot because um, I'm definitely not the same person, but it's just like my environment isn't changing. And it's kind of, I think because, or I know just because like, I was kind of wishing I was I was somewhere else. Or I wish I, I was wishing that I was in a different position in life instead of like being present and actually like, there was a lot of things internally that 
I had to go through that I had to experience, I had to become aware of, and the Lord like had to put me through for me to become aware of so that I could grow, so that I could, it's even hard to describe, bro. It's just like, there was a transformation that had to happen. You feel me? So um, if you wish you was in a different spot, I, for my situation, I had to embrace it. You feel me? And then once I embraced it and actually like became present and really, honestly, bro, like not even care, not even care. Like I was, I wouldn't say I was obsessed with like moving out and like getting my own spot or even going to Atlanta, but just like, I really, really, really wanted it, but you don't even want to be in a place of wanting. You want to, you know what I'm saying? You want to, you want to be set in yourself individually and like, you got to be it before you can see it. You feel me? So that's just, that's just what I had to go through, what I had to experience. Um, not everybody had to do that, but bro, at 24, you know, you could, I, I, I felt like I'm behind. I felt like, you know what I'm saying? What's wrong with me? You feel me? But everybody got their own journey. Like we cannot, I, I'm early on 21, 22, I was definitely comparing, but like, bro, I, we have to be like mad. We have to be mad confident in ourselves, mad faithful in the Lord, like mad, just, we have to embrace where we are, but then also do the work, do the work, bro. And really just be 100% real with ourselves, 100% real. I feel like I kind of, I wasn't, I lacked mad clarity or I didn't even take action on what I thought to be on what I was feeling at a time. So it's just like, just follow your intuition, bro. Follow your gut. Like that's, that, it really be talking to you. I ain't gonna lie. But yeah, that's enough talking, man. I'm about to get on the road back. Another two hours back to the crib, man. We, hey, I'm just happy we making motion. I'm just happy we are making motion, bro. Like, God is good. <laughs> but um, we'll see where we end up being. And uh, yeah, man, let's just have fun. Just do it. Let's go. Right now, you look like you like this shit. How'd I know? How'd I know? That's me on some psychic shit. I could tell a lie if you're asking me my way.